there YouTube, Corncob Piper coming at you. It is a Thursday uh, evening. Hope everybody's had a, a great week so far. Uh, got a uh, Yabo today from across the pond from uh, the UK. Um, I believe this is from, well actually I don't believe, I know, I'm pretty sure that it's from uh, Pipe Tree. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and link to his video as always uh, down below. Make sure if you haven't already done so, go check his channel out. Make sure you hit that sub button for him. He's a, he's a good dude. Uh, this We've done a couple exchanges. I really enjoy watching his videos. And he had done uh, a while back a 100 sub giveaway. And a really cool thing that he decided to do was make uh, everybody that entered into his uh, his giveaway that did a, did a VR make everybody a winner. So like, you know, every couple weeks he was doing uh, another drawing drawing a different winner each time so let's go ahead and we'll cut open uh, cut open his package it's taped pretty well and we'll see what kinds of goodies are are inside I know a while back um, Chris had sent me a uh, uh, pipe tree had sent me a, uh, a a couple of falcon pipes and some st. Bruno flake which uh, if you haven't tried st. Bruno flake definitely would recommend uh, Picking it up at some point it is a really delicious blend. Every time I smoke it, since I've gotten it, um, I've smoked in the, uh, the Falcon pipe. Um, I basically dedicated those pipes to um, like Burley Flakes. I smoked Stonehaven in it. I uh, got some uh, the Cornell and Deal uh, Burley Flakes all for them that I plan on smoking here soon. And I'll go ahead and, wow, well, there's a lot of stuff in here. I'll go ahead and review those for you. And you'll see me smoking that Falcon pipe. So, got a little postcard here. Uh, it says, Dear Corey, uh, sorry it's taken uh, so long to get this to you. Hope you enjoy. And then there's a, there's a PS, all the best tree. So, thank you, brother. I definitely really appreciate it. Wasn't expecting this much actually to come. So, thank you very much. So, first off, we got a tin here. It's called Tree Mixture. That's pretty cool. This is uh, Robert Lewis Tree Mixture. Uh, see if there's any kind of tin description on here because I've never heard of this. Uh, never heard of this blend, so this is definitely something that I'm going to have to look up. Uh, this, I would have to guess, is probably not a blend that we could get here in the States, so that's pretty awesome. Definitely looking to smoke in this. Um, I'll consider this, I guess, maybe an early Christmas present, so I'll go ahead and add this tobacco. Uh, to my uh, 2017 Christmas blend rotation and I'll give you guys some more information about that if you do uh, if you do have already smoked this anybody that's watching this go ahead and comment down below let me know what uh, what your thoughts on this tobacco are so that's very cool there also got a, uh, a beanbag uh, monkey with uh, um, a reindeer on there makes a good uh, good Christmas present. I'll go ahead and put this guy right there. And also uh, looks like a couple hats. So Boston Boston Celtics hat. Uh, my brother is a huge uh, Boston Celtics fan so I may end up uh, gifting him this hat. And then uh, a hat from Comb Mill. Um, which I've never heard of and there's a note inside the hat just saying that uh, he hasn't cleaned the hat yet because he didn't know how best to do it and uh, just get letting me know that you know go ahead and clean it which I definitely will do go ahead and run it and I uh, he sent me those I don't know he probably watched my video I collect uh, I'm a hat collector so uh, those will definitely go in my collection I may end up giving that other one to my brother not sure yet uh, just because I know he is a, a big Celtics fan. So there's a couple of estate pipes in here uh, also, which is super cool. And this is like, uh, this is all made from wood, including the stem, uh, which is pretty cool. This does not feel like briar. If I had to guess, I would guess maybe, maybe cherry or oak. So definitely a very cool pipe there. Uh, definitely looking forward to trying this guy out. And then also a nice, very, very small uh, bent pipe. 
There is no kind of marking on here that I could see. So this might be somewhat like something like a basket pipe, but it's got a very, very clean stem. Good grain on it. It's got some flame grain. I see a little bit of bird's eye on there, more flame grain on this side. So nice little pipe. I like that. This would probably go, uh, be a nice little pipe to smoke some Virginia flake in. Man, this is, this is a lot of stuff, man. You didn't have to, I wasn't expecting this much. I definitely really appreciate everything you, you sent me here. And then uh, another, Another little, uh, looks like a no-name uh, straight pipe. Very cool as well. Maybe use this. I've been trying to find a nice briar to dedicate for uh, aromatics, and this one might do the trick for that. I'm going to take a look at that. Just some beautiful pipes here, man. I really appreciate you sending me all this stuff. And then there's... Couple more, couple more envelopes in here. So let, let's see what else we got here. This one says do not bend. This photo was signed by Dan Marino and Don Strock when I met them in 1986 when I played in the Oxford Bulldogs versus the Cambridge County Cats game in the Budweiser League. So that is very, very awesome. Um, I live down here in Miami. My wife is a Miami Dolphins fan, so I'm sure that, you know, we'll get this guy framed up and hung somewhere in the house that is super cool. She's going to be very, very excited about that. Uh, I am too to get, you know, that kind of nostalgia. Even though I'm not a Dolphins fan, uh, you know, I've always been a fan of Dan Reno. He's one of the greatest quarterbacks, in my opinion, to ever, ever play the game. And this one says, as you like old things, I thought this would be fun. So we'll go ahead and see what's in this guy as well. Oh, very cool. So this is uh, this is uh, the Nashville Tennessean Magazine, uh, issue November 23rd, uh, 1952. Uh, looks like it's got some of the uh, Notre Dame Fighting Irish players on the front there. I'll have to go through this very, very carefully. I don't want to start opening this up on uh, camera and rip the pages. Uh, but definitely very cool as well, man. I really I really appreciate everything you send to me. I'm, I'm actually shocked at how much you sent, man. I, everything is truly appreciated. I really love the, the pipe span, and I'm looking forward to trying all those out. And then, like I said, I'll go ahead and get more information about this, this tree blend here. And I'll go ahead and add this into my holiday rotation. Uh, that way you could also see me doing a review on it uh, sometime uh, this winter as well. So everybody, once again, I'm going to post the link down to Pipe Tree's uh, channel down below. Make sure you head on over there. Check out his videos. You know, hit some like buttons on some of them. And, you know, hit that sub button for him as well if you haven't already done so. So very, very cool, Yabo. I'm definitely very excited about everything that I got. As always, you too, keep on piping.